You encounter buddies? You like them? It's a, it's a good talker, good uh, emotional speaker. Good for a laugh. All right. Uh, I'll just uh, see uh, see you later, okay? Uh, oh, hey, Peter. Matt. Matt, listen. Okay. Can you hold, hold on to these for a second? Yeah, sure. sure. Oh, okay. Oh, jeez. Got it. Oh, got it. Okay. Okay. So what Nicole asked me to do mm -hmm. was she wanted me to bring those. And Come on, Connor. <laughs> okay. I've had enough of it, man. What, why? It's been fun. Because I don't really like it when you know. I really don't like it, it's man. It's kind of funny, though. You, you know? It's You're very awkwardly put together. It's fun to make fun of those things. We have to celebrate our differences, Matt. Jesus. Gee, damn it, Glenn. I can't do this anymore. These people are just... A hey, Connor. Hi, what's up? How's it going, buddy? That's good. Hey, Nick. Hey. Yeah, he's my, that's my big sib. Was your big sib? What? What do you mean? I got rid of you. What, did you trade me or? Yep, sort of like that. Well, who's kind of cut you? Got a, you're a free agent now. Pick someone up new. His name's Philippe. That's that's interesting. Yeah. Hey, uh, what's your uh, cell phone number, by the way? I was gonna I was gonna call you. Um. I'm having a really? Mother's Day barbecue and oops! Oh. Are you serious right now? No, I'm just kidding. I know. You're still going with that. I know your mom's dead. It's okay. You don't have to worry about it. I'm just joking. Your mother walks into a Are bar. I'm right? no, just kidding. Seriously, dude. Cut the crap. What? Let's just move this and I'm never going to speak to you again. Just no, don't mom. touch me. Listen, Nick, you have to accept the comic of the tragic that's rule number eight of acting. Whatever, dude. I can't. Boho! Cancer, schmancer! You know what, Connor? Ever since you freaking came here, you're screwed up! Why don't you just go back to Hollywood or wherever the frick you came from? Frick? What are you, seven? <laughs> Looks. Ah! Child development took a detour when your mom went down to the grave in the sky. What a baby. Excuse me, I need to get some new goggles after that black kid chased me. Oh, okay. How you doing, buddy? Oh, Connor, Hi. this is, um... Alex. Alex, how you Hi. doing? Hi, nice Hi. to meet Who's you. Connor? Nice to meet you, Connor. We you? made at the beginning of the year. You're the roommate? Yeah. Yeah. Oh! I'm, I'm Peter's roommate, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. He no, I, you're not my roommate. I'm living by myself because... Uh, you're, we're roommates now because he didn't like you. No, because... Well, wait was, a minute. That's not what you said. You said no, you that, shut the hell up. I got a sign. What, what are you they, talking uh, about? Bruce Willis different... this. Bruce hey. Willis that. Okay. Bruce Willis this. Hey, no, Bruce Willis Paul, is man. a very talented actor. <laughs> yeah. I... Let's face this, Glenn. Look, I was second in line for that movie Mercury Rising. I was almost there, all right? Bruce Willis... Turd on the hey, Ritz. Don't, don't. How? What, what, no, did you no, lie? no, 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 no. Wait, wait. I, I got assigned a different Alex, room. Alex, listen, listen, listen. By all I'm saying is, Peter campus was people. eating was eating a burger and he got a delicious, delicious steak. Am I right, Glenn? Am I? Get out of my way. Jeez, what the hell? Jeez, he's about as moody as a. Ish. Got my goggles. Well, I've got a mess to clean up. Is this everybody? I think so. Uh, all right, so the reason you're all here is I'm gonna issue a general apology to each of you for the way Connor's been behaving throughout strike. I mean, not just strike, throughout his entire presence at Marquette University. <coughs> um, fully. I'm sorry he gave you hypothermia when he locked you out of the apartment. It's That's okay. wrong, and I, I hope you uh, heal quickly. Um, Mornson, I would like to extend a heartfelt apology to you for the numerous comments you made about your dead mother. That was completely out of line. Uh, Nicole, sorry he undermined your authority throughout the strike. That was very unprofessional, and I extend my deepest sympathy. Kevin, 
I'm sorry you got the sawdust in your eyes when you did that stupid magic trick. I know it was dumb, it wasn't funny. You have an eye problem, and I'm sorry he called you a <laughs> Yeah, that, that, that was the icing on the cake, and I, again, for that, I'm extremely, extremely sorry. <sighs> Matt. I'm sorry he squeezes your cheeks every time he sees you. That, that's just obnoxious. You're not a pumpkin. I'm sorry that Kool-Aid man joke was completely out of line. I, I'm sorry. Alex. <sighs> sorry he told you I hate you. I, I don't really hate you. I just, I needed to get out of that room because somebody was going to die if I, if I stayed any longer. And I'm going to do whatever I can to get you a Bruce Willis poster. I'm working on an Unbreakable. We'll see what happens, okay? And, uh, finally... Nick, um, he didn't do anything today, I know, but he's just been a general dick to you throughout the entire semester. I can't think of a single time he wasn't, and for that, again, I am very, very, very sorry. Okay? Sure. So, but I think... Where's Steven? Oh, um, he couldn't be here. He was very upset by, I remember, the racial comment, and I think he's trying to file something with the NAACP or maybe the administration. I don't know how far he's going to go, but and, he, and he's well within his right to do that because that was extremely rude and racist and insensitive and intolerant. But that's important because we've all been scarred by Connor. I've been scarred by Connor. You've been scarred by Connor. And that's why it's important for us to unite as a department and overcome these horrible, horrible experiences. Am I right, everybody? Yeah. yeah. So let's do it. Yeah, right. Let's put it behind us and forget about every nasty, horrible thing Connor has done to us. Okay? Yeah. Am I right? Yeah! yeah. yeah. All right. Oh, he takes forever. Oh, well, finally. Oh. What are you doing in there? Ah, uh, nothing. Just talking to some people. Guy Grace. Right. Yeah. Uh, how are you? Uh, I'm a bad day, you know. You know, it was your first strike. I really always... like the sign. It's a little rough. Everyone oh, was just, I... Everyone was just really difficult, Glenn thought it was know? funny. Yeah. Yeah. It's a funny sign. I don't know. Everybody here is just kind of a jerk in a box. I don't know. Well, I think, I think you got to give them some time. They'll grow on you after a yeah, while. Yeah, but I think it's kind of cool, you know, that, like, me and you were, were kind of outcasts, you know, and... It's nice. It's nice. It's like nice that somebody else is there with me, and it's just kind of cool. Well, you, you know, they might take us under their way I eventually. I mean, they're kind of stood up in their ways, might, you know. Might even take me back, I think. Peter, please. We're birds of a feather, you know what I mean? we got to stick together, thick or thin, creamy or crunchy, uh, chocolate or yeah, 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 wild yeah, raspberry. You know, we got to yeah, stay together. Yeah. What? Oh, I think there was a cat fight going on. Say, beat her, beat her, beat her. A cat no, fight? No, 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 no. Let's go. No, no, no. Okay. Okay. <laughs> the girls were ugly. Anyway. Oh, well, yeah. Yeah, that's just constant. Alright, well, why don't we just go with uh, the we want to get some meat, ice cream, um, ice cream. I was thinking of steak, Peter, ice cream. Yeah. The ice cream? Yes. Uh, yes, Connor. All right, we'll get yeah. ice cream. Then away we go! Let's go get ice cream. Yeah, go on. Yeah. Yeah.